Have you ever wondered what the seven wonders of the ancient world were? These magnificent structures were built thousands of years ago, yet they still capture our imagination today. Join us as we travel back in time and explore these remarkable feats of engineering and architecture. 1. The Great Pyramid of Giza How was the Great Pyramid of Giza built to be so massively huge and precise? This ancient wonder dates back over 4,000, 500 years and still puzzles modern engineers. It was built as a tomb for the pharaoh Khufu around 2560 BCE. This immense pyramid structure measures a towering 146 meters tall and comprises over 2 million precisely aligned blocks of stone, with each block weighing approximately 2 to 3 tons. To construct this monumental feat, it is estimated that over 30,000 workers labored for 20 years. Using only ropes, levers, pulleys and ramps as basic tools, they were able to quarry, transport, and meticulously stack the heavy stones into the shape of a pyramid. The pyramid's base covers over 13 acres of land, and the whole colossal structure weighs a staggering 6 million tons. Inside this giant stone edifice is a series of passages and chambers where Khufu was buried alongside treasures and essential provisions for the afterlife. The inner walls were originally lined with fine white limestone, while the outer casings were made of polished white marble that would gleam brightly under the Egyptian sun. For nearly 4,000 years, the Great Pyramid of Giza remained the tallest structure ever built by humans. It continues to be a true testament to the planning, skill, and backbreaking effort put in by ancient Egyptian builders. 2. Hanging Gardens of Babylon What made the legendary Hanging Gardens of Babylon one of the most wondrous sights of the ancient world. According to ancient texts, these lush gardens were built around 600 BCE in the ancient city of Babylon, near present-day Baghdad in Iraq, by King Nebuchadnezzar II for his Median wife Queen Amethis. As the story goes, Queen Amethis deeply missed the green hills and wooded mountains of her homeland. To help her feel at home, Nebuchadnezzar commissioned the hanging gardens to be built. This garden feat featured a tall brick terraced, stepped pyramid structure rising over 75 feet high. It was waterproofed using layers of lead and reed matting, allowing large trees and plants to grow on each step terrace. A complex irrigation system with iron pumps and bronze pipes brought water from the nearby Euphrates River to flow throughout the gardens. This allowed a dazzling array of vines, flowers, herbs, bushes and trees to thrive in the desert climate. The gardens became a verdant, green oasis of botanical and engineering splendor. Though limited Babylonian records refer to the hanging gardens, detailed accounts from ancient Greek sources describe this garden paradise as an unparalleled site in the ancient world. 3. Temple of Artemis Why was the Temple of Artemis regarded as an architectural wonder of the ancient world? This enormous temple was dedicated to Artemis, the Greek goddess of the hunt, and one of the most revered deities in ancient Greece. It was located in Ephesus, an important Greek port city that now lies in ruins near Selthuk in modern-day Turkey. Constructed over 120 years and completed around 550 BCE, the Temple of Artemis awed visitors with its monumental size and imposing grandeur. It spanned over 420 feet long and 220 feet wide, and its columns reached 60 feet high. The sheer scale of the marble temple, along with its ornate details, made it the biggest temple in the ancient world. The temple became an important pilgrimage site for worshippers of Artemis, and its enormity drew sightseers from distant lands. In 356 BCE, it was deliberately destroyed in an act of arson, but was soon rebuilt to be even larger and grander than before. It stood as an imposing marvel until 268 CE, when Germanic invaders attacked and demolished it. 4. Statue of Zeus at Olympia What made the Statue of Zeus one of the most revered artworks of ancient Greece? This massive seated statue depicted Zeus, the king of gods in ancient Greek mythology. It was located inside his temple at Olympia, the site of the ancient Olympic Games. The statue was sculpted by the renowned Greek artist Phidias around 435 BCE. It measured over 40 feet tall and was carved from ivory plates and gold panels placed over an internal wooden framework. The level of artistic detail was considered unmatched in the ancient world. 
The statue showed Zeus seated on an ornate cedarwood throne. He had a wreath of carved olive leaves on his head and held the goddess Nike, representing victory, in his right hand. His left hand held a scepter with a majestic eagle perched on top. The statue's beauty and imposing size made Zeus seem truly all-powerful. The Temple of Zeus at Olympia became an important religious and cultural destination in ancient Greece. This statue was considered the perfect representation of Zeus and a masterpiece of Greek sculpture. 5. Mausoleum at Halicarnassus Why was the mausoleum at Halicarnassus considered such a uniquely lavish ancient tomb? The mausoleum was built around 353 BCE as the final resting place for Mausolus, the powerful governor of Caria in southwestern Turkey. When Mausolus died, his devoted wife Artemisia decided to construct an extraordinary tomb that would befit her husband's legacy. The monumental tomb stood about 140 feet tall and was ornately decorated with intricate friezes, columns, and statues along its base and up to the very top. At the pinnacle was an enormous four-horse marble chariot sculpture with Mausolus and Artemisia riding in it. The tomb's total magnificence and huge scale made it renowned as one of the grandest structures in the ancient world. The lavish mausoleum was designed by renowned Greek architects and its name became the root for the modern word mausoleum. For many centuries after its completion, the tomb stood prominently on the landscape overlooking Halicarnassus as a testament to Mausolus' wealth and status. 6. Colossus of Rhodes What made the Colossus of Rhodes such a miraculous ancient statue? This gigantic 33-meter-tall bronze statue depicted the Greek sun god Helios and overlooked the busy harbor entrance on the island of Rhodes. It was erected in 280 BCE to commemorate Rhodes' victory over an invading army. The Colossus was designed by the sculptor chairs of Lindos and took 12 long years to build. Given its tremendous size, historians believe it stood with one leg on each side of the harbor entrance, essentially straddling the mouth of the harbor. The magnificent statue stood intact until 226 BCE when it was toppled by a powerful earthquake. Its massive fallen pieces lay along the harbor entrance for centuries, making the passage impassable for ships until the bronze remnants were eventually removed. The sheer size and beauty of the Colossus made it legendary throughout the ancient world. 7. Lighthouse of Alexandria What made the soaring Lighthouse of Alexandria an essential ancient wonder? The lighthouse was located on a small island called Pharos, just off the coast of the ancient city of Alexandria in Egypt. At an estimated height of over 440 feet, it was among the tallest structures on Earth for many centuries after its construction. It was completed around 280 BCE after 12 years of construction. This enormous lighthouse had three stacked sections, a square base, an octagonal middle, and a cylindrical beacon chamber on top. Fires were lit in the beacon at night, and its light could be seen for over 30 miles to safely guide ships back to the Alexandria Harbor. The lighthouse complemented the Great Library of Alexandria as a crowning achievement of Hellenistic architecture in ancient Egypt. After withstanding repeated earthquakes, it was eventually destroyed by one in 1326 CE. The immense scale and utility of the Lighthouse of Alexandria cemented its reputation as a true engineering marvel of the ancient world. Outro The Seven Wonders of the Ancient World give us an incredible window into the ambitious projects and engineering capabilities of ancient civilizations. While only the Great Pyramid of Giza remains today, the other wonders continue to inspire a sense of awe at human imagination and ingenuity. We hope you enjoyed this overview of these legendary ancient marvels. Let us know in the comments which ancient wonder fascinated you the most. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe to join us for more journeys into the epic history of our world.